Hello again, everybody. This is L. This is Q. And this is A. And we're going to be playing Robots. Robot. Robots. A.K.A. Robin Williams, the game. Oh, that's super loud. <laughs> Just like take a take a moment to appreciate how nice the PlayStation 2 startup sound is. Oh no, what's going on? We always it's not that. recording the thing. True. What thing? The game thing. <laughs> the game thing? It's not recording the game thing. Hold the on. game genie. The video. Oh, it was. Was it? Or, or the game is. genie, was it working or not working? I don't know. It should be showing us that. <laughs> but right whenever it said robots, it started showing. There we go. <laughs> Do you want like a bowl of cereal or something? I'm good. All right. Q is not feeling well. He's very hungover, I'm hungover. right now. Mm -hmm. But I'm going to be playing this because that way I don't have to talk. <laughs> what? Fair. Fair. But also, this is your game. You demanded this game. Because it's kind of lame. It's pretty lame. That's more <coughs> intricate than the original Fox intro bumper. <laughs> What's that about? Eh. You know, eh. you know, Fox, they know where to spend their money. Is this Sierra? Yeah. Sierra. I'm just surprised, like, Fox made logo. a game. I know my logos. It's a lot of logos on this. Does Ian McGregor voice the game? Hey. Two more logos. I think... If I'm, oh, not, no. if, if, right. if <laughs> I'm not correct, I think it's uh, Ewan McGregor's stand-in voice actor. So it's like Jackie Chan Adventures? Not that bad. Like, this guy kind of sounds like Ewan McGregor. He's a, I think he's the same guy in uh, Clone Wars. It's bonus features. Oh. No yeah. robots data has been saved. Probably. You haven't unlocked any bonus features, bro. Yeah, you need to unlock anything. more bonus features. Oh, shit. If you okay. want, I can game shark one, this. Two. Yeah. <laughs> one, two, one, two. Now we're probably. Would that, like, overcomplicate the program? Like, going what? through game shark and then. Oh, no, it's the... all native. It's uh, all native. It's fine. It's it's built into the system over here. Ah, nice. Yeah, yeah. so. I mean. I could do it, but you know, you know what <laughs> we should do as well. Like, uh, we should play uh, Spider-Man the movie, the this game, my son. and just we'll name all, all the game sharks. Rodney Copperbottom. He showed great interest in inventing ever yeah. since he first saw Big Weld. From then yeah. on, he never missed an episode. So, like, whenever they got like they somebody delivered them their baby, and they had to make he the really baby. Big and they were, and they made a, an adult you joke of shine, like making no the baby is the funnest made. part. And we gave Rodney all the and right. I was just like, wow, wow, robots, wow. This is a kid show. I have never watched robots. This is a kid ever. movie. I, I don't remember that joke. I don't remember that scene. I remember that. Thank that you was, for ruining my childhood, Q. That was, it was a pretty, hey, Rodney, probably the funniest thing. And he's a dishwasher, and it looks like he's wearing an apron. Because he's a fry cook? Take a look around, he's a dishwasher. Ah. Oh, that makes sense, because he has a dishwasher for a chest. Yeah. Well, like, your legs are, like, thick. That makes you look like you wear shorts. Yeah, I'm like... You're a child. Yeah, we're kid. You're, you're kid a kid bot. Kid. All right, kid so bro. what happened in the movie? Um, Right now, we're just kind of, like, in a tutorial area. Yeah, we're in, like, the prologue. Well, we're, like... Because, like, he's, during the he's, movie, he, hit, he hits puberty, and he, like, installs new hardware. Okay. Not really. He just... He, he kind of just stays the same. No, no, no. He gets taller. Oh, well, yeah. He gets... Yeah. He grows. Yeah, he's he, he's an adult when he hits the city. There's, there's simple platforming shit. Uh, the, okay, hold on. The thing is... Let me try that. You ever watch like that cartoon uh, Roly Poly Oli? Yeah. That kind of reminds me of that. I've seen it in passing. Hey Rodney, glad you made it. Like even as a child I realized that cartoon was weird. See these crates? You know what's weird? Those two banana guys? 
two Use banana guys? Yeah, there's just two ba bananas in pajamas. <laughs> what? Do you not know bananas in pajamas? No, are you making something up to me? No, it's it's this old. It sounds made up. No. Just bananas and pajamas. Oh, we're gathering. Right now we're gathering blueprints because we're making the, our little spoon thing, our little buddy. I thought it's for you to hit puberty. No, we we're making our we're because we're an inventor. You remember these we guys? We make things. Oh my god, this this is a for real thing. Like yeah. what? They don't talk either, so it's like they're like miming the whole. It's like two Mr. Beans. That's weird. It's super fucking weird. <laughs> It was the most boring uh, show on the earth. Okay, on that on that note, have you ever watched uh, Augie and the Cockroaches? No. It was about these two cats that live together in a... Uh, well, like, it's a pretty big house, honestly. They're roommates. But, like, they get tormented by this trio of cockroaches. Mm. It's a French <laughs> show. French people are weird. Hey, I'm French. No, not really. Tormenting. I hear Paris is terrible. Like, Paris is supposed to be, like, this... Nice romantic place. Well, it, it it suffers the thing of like, oh, like There's people like imagine. There's like rats everywhere. People imagine. Oh, R two. Okay. And just the whole place smells like pee. It's it's it's, it's like, like it's, worse New York if you think about it, because like it has worse well races. Well done, son. That's There's like an actual thing of like people, I'm if they go to, to the Paris, hall. they expect There's it to be like this great there. thing, Come find and get a then they find out that it's not, and they get depressed. Like it's an actual thing. See, it's like worse than New York because, like, New York like at Paris least it takes you the like second that. trip for you to realize that New York is not that great. Like, then you realize then the pile hate. of trash and the smell of trash and all the homeless meth heads and stuff. Dude, I was in New York for like five days, and the whole place smelled like, you know, like, you know how whenever you throw popsicles in the garbage, and so the garbage smells sweet. <laughs> They're on wheels, that's but it's still hot, terrible garbage. That's, that still doesn't sound good to me. Like, yeah, no, it's bad. But no, I know, I know what you're describing, and yeah, it did. Well, Rodney, time to test Not even the smell of weed could Pop cover up that like It'll garbage up smell. Up Is that your robot, Dad? Once you yeah. All the Wonderbot pieces. He's got a robot mom too. To me, but we'll I don't know if they ever show her in the game. It's been a while since I played this. Robin Williams was great in this movie. Robin Williams is in this movie. Yes, yeah. he's uh he's your buddy. He's like the he's comedic the, relief. He's the comedic best friend in the movie. Man, I really just that like, gets you that gets the main character in trouble all the time. I miss this then. That's too bad. I don't know. I really don't think you missed much with this movie. <laughs> it's okay movie. I mean, Robin yeah. Williams and uh, Yeah, but it's no Aladdin. Yeah, it's it's just like if you if you're right thinking movie. like this is gonna be great like Aladdin, but like nah, well, like I'm, underutilized. He does the same thing he does in like animated movies where he does like voices and impressions, but like felt like they underutilized Robin Williams in this movie. Is it is it at least like Fern Gully? <laughs> no. No. Really? It's like, okay. I it's, guess I'll, I'll be honest. Right I don't like Fern Gully. What? Yeah. it's... it's I think it's because I watched it after Avatar. But Robin Williams is a bat. I know. <laughs> I know. I know. I know. He's a But also, like, I don't like Avatar as well. I think it's just, like, the... There's just something about that movie that just felt preachy to me, and I was like, nah. But Tim it's Curry just, it's just space. There's a lot of stuff with Tim Curry that's amazing, okay? Like, Clue. Clue's amazing. That movie with, like, the boats... Mikhail's Navy. Mikhail's. It's like uh, if uh, it's uh, it's it's like it's if if it's Magnum PI but on boats. I'm not saying this. Bruce Campbell is in the movie. <laughs> like I understand this isn't like a Magnum Opus, but is it like, is it a slice of well Americana? <laughs> no, it's like an action adventure movie. Let's well, like, I wouldn't say action, but it's like an adventure movie. It's a, a comedy adventure movie. Like, he falls in love, he gets some there new hardware, go. he's trying to get a Rob job. Really like, it, it's a whirlwind it's a of a movie. Invention. There's, like, class warfare. Like oh. Yeah, actually. <laughs> there's, like, yeah. There, there's, like, we need to get these people new upgrades, but they're, work. like, really expensive. And, like, diner, people just want to have just to be able just to be fixed. It's our, our health care. It's the health care system. This movie's deep. Uh, also, I think there's a twist of like planned obsolescence in the movie as well. Made it kind of messed up. 
So like robots are made to die? They're After... made to be broken. Oh look, so they he, can get he, and keep, I'm, keep the I just grew up. Going. I just grew up in like 20 minutes. Yeah. Wow. See? That's how he normally looks in the movie. And I got a wrench. I got a big old wrench. I got a springy leg. If you were a robot, you could attach anything to your pelvic area and it would be a penis. <laughs> Unless it's a vagina. But, like, you could use that wrench and then just bolt that wrench to... <laughs> or, like, what I don't know, telephone what poles. What or... about if you put a vacuum cleaner there? Is oh. it a dick or is We're it a vagina? Here. It's pointy and it provides suction. Mm. Well, uh, do you know what docking is? <laughs> <laughs> well, they do talk about. <laughs> <laughs> Let's not talk about it. But well, Robin, yeah. <laughs> Robin Williams, actually, I think at one point he turns into a girl. He's like, his thing is that he's falling apart. Like he's, like in the, in the movie, he's just kind of grabbing shit and just kind of like putting j other parts onto him. What you're saying is so like, and he like ends up wearing a dress. I don't know if it's like the he prophecy ends up as a girl. of Robin Williams. <laughs> Poor guy. Now, Rodney, yeah, of course, yeah. so you need to be able to look after yourself. At least we still have a huge backlog of stuff that he did and bless machine. the world with it. Hold down yeah. the inventory button. You ever watch the commercial the with Rob Williams? Uh, with his daughter, Zelda? I don't know, but it's it was a promotional thing for The Legend of Zelda on yeah. DS. Yeah, I've seen that. I've seen that, that was dope times. as fuck. That's the scrap He's talking about his daughter. He's like, I, you know... Let's get sailed whatever control. and I defeated See monsters just to there? save you Try and then his daughter shows up and his daughter's name is Zelda mm -hmm. so it's like she's are the... you talking about me or <laughs> she's the she's she also voices the villain in Legend of Korra, uh, Korra. Mm. oh mm -hmm. huh. how do I, how do, how do I know is good Having also she like cosplayed as uh, Link over there and I like that it's good stuff oh I can't Aim. I'm watching uh, all of Avatar right now. I think I'm like eight episodes into the first season. Um, a lot of people told me it was great, but Excellent I watched it in passing. Mr. And, uh, probably it was too like those, friendship is magic for it, me. Then it's worth so I kind of stayed off. See, on anyway, I eat that I'll shit up. Like friendship now. is magic. There's okay. I understand that, but I don't need to be told that every that time. And, like me? simple mechanics of like. And hit the bullseye. Interacting the socially belt. don't need to be spelled out all the way sometimes. Well, like, the, the thing that made uh, Avatar Last Airbender cool was, like, it was kind of a character study of those people. Like, well Aang done. is naive for a reason use the because he doesn't really interact with the outside robots, world other than the monks scrap. that were with him. If and now he's out, the last one of them. But so he's kind of a little confused Listen, and just Rodney. needs somebody to help Some him out. The and then you got Sokka with his inferiority complex because he doesn't have bending powers. Meet me outside the town hall once you're finished. Yeah. And then you have frickin' Zuko with his bigger inferiority complex because he's the bad guy. Yeah. I'm, I'm witnessing all of those things. I just, uh, I don't know, I like Legend of Korra better. You know, I'm the opposite. I, mm. uh, I, I prefer I Airbender over Legend, Legend of Korra. I have Legend of Korra. Mm. There's metal bending and, and well, blood bending. They have that in, in, like... I don't know. It's just, like, it was too dramatic for me. Like, I I, I enjoyed the kid-friendliness of Airbender. Okay, can I talk about super lameness of having the your ammo be collectible shit? What? Seriously? Yeah. Your collectibles are your ammo? Like, you shoot... That your, your, sucks. Your, your scrap. Do you need a specific amount of collectibles to do shit? So like your 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 currency is your. Yeah, like I, I, I didn't your, say collect. I shouldn't have said collectibles, but like your currency, yeah. Oh, this is uh, Metro Twenty Thirty Three. I suppose. Mm -hmm. Left. All right. All right, Dad. That's that's such a cool like idea for a post-apocalyptic setting, because like yeah, why wouldn't you pay with bullets? Yeah, like Metro. But it's like good, like it's it's not ammo. It's the good ammo that you can use also in your your shitty gun, and it will be like really good ammo. Like it's practically like it's worth to use it sometimes. Like the ammo in Metro. No, no, I'm saying I understand what you're saying. You said it's the really good ammo. Like, yeah. yeah, I get it. Yeah, we got that. Like you use that to buy other good ammo or more ammo. Well, oh, I can only get 200, so I'm collecting all this shit for nothing. Well, don't do that. <laughs> I don't care. 
my my inner like I gotta collect them all. Your uh, waka waka sense. Yeah. So did you just like have no money and like bought this out of the bargain bin and then yeah, like I just went to GameStop and I was just like I wanted to get a game and this was pretty cheap and I was like I like the movie. Well. No, it's before the whole thing with like, oh, they don't like people oh, snooping around for lost movie games are bad, except, except the Toy Story three game. That game is fucking sick. There's like a whole, you play through the level. You y'all watch Toy Story two? Mm-hmm. You remember the beginning where Buzz goes through that whole thing? Yeah, with Zerg. What Zerg? Yeah. You do that in the game. Nice. That's it's cool. sick. That reminds me of the Buzz Lightyear game on the PS1. And then they have like a whole... Um, it was based off of the Buzz Lightyear cartoon. Like a whole... Um, oh, I, I remember that. that cartoon. It was pretty fun. I liked it. I think it was uh, Patrick Warburton voicing Buzz. And they have like uh, the same, like the toy box, which is just like, hey... You build a little, you build a little western town, and you buy little things, and you can dress them up. Like the people that made that game went on to make the uh, Disney Infinity stuff. Ah. So like the sandbox is just the beginning of the Disney Infinity stuff. It's the prototype. Yeah, the Infinity. prototype. And it's really sick. Like I, I spent like a good time playing a good bit of things, and like a lot of it is just kind of fucking right. around. You were standing right in front of that guy and shot Thanks. some other guy 12 feet away completely to the left. Well, there's no, like, like this is what I'm, like, you have this as your lock on. Also, that thi sounds terrible. Also, this game has the Metal Gear syndrome of, like, ah, aim, it's first person. But, like, the rest of the time, you're third person. Man. And it it's a, it's a nice touch. I, I actually like that. I'm like, mama, I enjoy that mechanic. More games should do that. There's a, there's a le level of whimsy here. That, uh, it's good. It's yeah. good whim. Like it, it, it has a good look at least. It's got good whim, but not enough C. You know what I mean? Yeah. These, these are very, very, these are very good toppings, but like, ah, yeah. Well, like it, it's just it lacks substance. There's the meat and potatoes. Yeah, it's like, a movie game. That's true. Screw this. I'm gonna go. I think you're supposed to do the whole like ground stomp thing yeah. and to keep it frozen. Pull the lever, crunk. Ooh, health. Oh, what? Actually, they're. And it like messes with. Great. And it messes with the camera. No. Oh. I gotta fix. I fix things. It's I'm a fixer. You know what? It was actually a good movie game. The Incredibles game. I want to turn that off. I never experienced that. Oh, it was pretty cool. Like, you start off the game as uh, Young Mr. Incredible. And you kind of, like, play out the entire movie, but you switch between characters. Hmm. Everybody's got their own, like, mechanics going on for them. Yeah. Some, uh, some of the stuff is, like, co-op. Like, most Pixar stuff is pretty always pretty good. Stomp. Ooh. So is this, like, a platformer or something? Yeah. And there's, like, uh, the ball part that's, like, kind of, like, racing game-ish. Or maybe shoot the thing. The scrap. Robots. Nope. All right. I don't know what I'm doing. Not a button. You know, honestly, if, like, if I, if I walked into this game without, like, prior knowledge of the movie Robots, I would probably enjoy this. It's, it's not that not, bad. It's not bad, but it's not great. It's like, like this is all you do. It's just kind of jump around, do shit. I mean, if you like platforming, this is yeah. like right up your alley. It's like less battling Ratchet and Clank. Yeah. yeah. It's less interesting Jack and Daxter. Where am I going now? Yeah, zipline. Hmm. Ooh. Alright, now how am I supposed to get across here? They don't say how. How do you turn it off? Can you shoot the lever from there? 
I think you're supposed to like screw those like uh, things shut. Screw the fans. Oh, yeah. I gotta oh. hold it. Games are hard. <laughs> As a kid, I never would have gotten that. Oh, it's oily. <laughs> Always like playing around with the, the ice physics, I guess. Is what you would call them. Um, what happens next? I think I gotta go over here now. Right. There. Well, honestly, like thinking really hard right now about like good, like movie games. There's not much. The the Lego stuff, if you count those. They're more Lego game, like they're act more of an actual game than like movie games, but they always use like movie stuff. True. What about good like TV shows? Like the Lego show Star games. Wars ones are <laughs> fucking phenomenal. 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 Oh, dude, I should totally download the PlayStation 2 Buffy the Vampire Slayer game. <laughs> of course. Oh god. <laughs> you must. You mean buy it with your money so we can play it on our our approved PlayStation? That we've preserved for years yeah. and not modded ever. Uh, mm. I would agree with you if like those people got the money from what I was buying, but that is no longer the case, so it doesn't even matter. I don't even think those people exist anymore. Fair enough. Fair enough. Alright, what do I do now? Honestly, like you, you probably have a hard time actually buying it in a physical copy. Uh, Dragon Ball 3, Tenkaichi 3. That's, that's a good TV show game. <laughs> Budokai. Budokai, yeah. Budokai 1, 2, and 3. 1, 2, and 3. I have 3 here. Ah, it's a good game. Good game. You know what's not a good game that's a movie game? What? Street Fighter, the movie, the game. What about Dragon Ball, the movie, the game on PSP? Is that <laughs> a thing? That is a thing. <laughs> I need to bleach my brain now. Yeah, it was pretty bad. You remember Piccolo? Yeah, I remember how how, how bad Piccolo looked, All okay? Green. <laughs> I, I still can't bleach that out of my brain, okay? Do I have to... Oh, okay, I gotta do that now. What about Street Fighter, the movie, the game? That's what, that's what I said. Like, Street Fighter, the movie, the game, that was basically Mortal Kombat like one of the worst but things didn't, ever. didn't it go back around too? Wasn't there like a Street Fighter the movie the game the movie? No wait. <laughs> Street Fighter the game? No wait. <laughs> no no. Like okay so like after their adventure making Street Fighter the movie they made Street Fighter the movie the game and then they realized no never again. And then they made Street Fighter 2 the movie which was an animated adaptation of Street Fighter 2 the game. Right, where do I go now? That sounds awful. It's actually, it wasn't bad. It was pretty cool. You got to see, like, half-naked uh, Chun-Li fight oh, Vega, yeah, yeah. who's pervin in the background. I, the I much scene. prefer Street Fighter Alpha, the movie. It's a good anime. Uh, There's a Jackie where do I Chan go now? fighter that has, like, six versions of Jackie Chan in it. <laughs> we need to play that. That sounds amazing. It's an arcade-only game, so I'd have to, like... Pick it off of a mommy run, but yeah, that sounds like some Mugen type shit. Like it is. Let's like sadly, Mugen is like way better than this game. Oh, <laughs> but yeah, you got like drunken master Jackie Chan, and then you got like like the uh, tuxedo Jackie Chan. No, I don't think you do have the tuxedo because this was before tuxedo, so this was like nineteen ninety five, ninety eight. Okay, down there. So you got like oh there it is uh some movie where he played like a dragon like like you know those like Chinese opera style like mm -hmm. yeah so he, he's he's trained in that he's actually what yeah, that's yeah. what he does in China that's what he did whenever he was a kid growing up so there's that and then um, there's a bunch of other like stereotyped. Like there's a stick guy and there's a girl that does like. But I'm girl like, I'm, 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 I'm curious what's like the most iconic like Jackie Chan roles that occupy those five slots. Like, so like Drunken Master Jackie Chan makes sense because like that's where he like got popular. Um, 
Maybe Rush Hour, Jackie Chan? No, this was this was before that. Battle Battle in the Bronx, Jackie Chan? Kung Fu Master Jackie Chan. Okay, look, what do we got here? It's 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 literally Jackie Chan but different colors. Jackie Chan, Jackie Chan. <laughs> it's like Jackie Chan in different colored robes. It looks like Mortal Kombat, but Jackie Chan. This is amazing. Oh, so it's different styles. So there's like Snake and Eagle Shadow style. Nice. And then. Well, like that's what I figured is like different oh, versions, different styles. That right there, that's him from uh, uh, Project A2. Do they and, have like police story Jackie Chan? I just had to uh, to that guy's from Super Cop. <laughs> I don't know who the rest of these people are. That that one right there, that's Jackie Chan. <laughs> that's still Jackie Chan? Hell that's yeah. still Jackie Chan. Hell yeah. Uh, what is that yeah. blue dude? Is that still Jackie Chan? No, I think that's Andy Lau. Oh, okay. And that guy is the eagle in Snake and Eagle Shadow. So, And this is just a rando girl. I don't even know who that is. Hi, Rodney. That gold scrap has Isn't it great? In your pocket. Like yeah, this, this visually, this pot, or not pot, <laughs> this let's play, hey, we're hey. like all staring at a picture that they can't see, and it is this. Y'all were, I'm playing the game. Uh, I, I got I, enough scrap, I, so now I, I'm going to the big city. I have, I have the answer for this, L. We'll fix it in post. We'll just <laughs> we'll just have like a good five minutes of dead air <laughs> while Q Jeez. plays robots. You could probably just like mute our audio and like the audience will never know that we were talking about Jackie Chan straight for like fifteen minutes. No, no, we'll keep it. It's important. Then you gotta like throw in the picture of the multicolored Jackie Chan. Well, Kevin Bacon. We it. began to realize. And we'll have to like degrees. cover these parts. Look, there's his mom. Or at least I realized it. This looks His really good. This is from the movie. Idea. Yeah, this is the movie. I well, knew Rodney okay. would eventually but even still, movie. like, video rendering if back was then wasn't really all that yeah. great. Like, it wasn't a bad movie and didn't look bad either. It was just kind of like, meh. It didn't suffer from being too good or too bad. It was just right in the middle. It was average. That's, yeah. like, the, the problem with it. This is also 2005. It doesn't break any new ground. It doesn't do, do anything have, crazy. Do you have more stuff in your goodie bag? Lee? More like food? Yeah. No, it was just no. those two things. You can have some more <laughs> of those two things wherever they are. Right? Hey. Uh, Look at this hunk of do junk. You want some more mustard piece? The, the wasabi piece? Oh, yeah, I'll take wasabi piece. Yeah. I can tell y'all are really into this game. It's either that or like low carb drinks from my car. No, nah, I'm okay with the wasabi piece. These are cool. I have an emergency Rice Krispies. <laughs> Look at this guy. I, I, bought, I bought a big bag of like the Reese's like puffs. They're like gifts from heaven. Did you just destroy that newspaper box? What was that? It was like just a Was box. that newspaper box sentient? No. First? The, uh, this, the male thing is. Look, he's got eyes and arms. I think they have a scene in the thing where he like, he does something and they're just like, hey, I'm walking in. And it's just like, oh, sorry. If I remember correctly. So wait, so if they're robots and machines are sentient, then like, what determines a, th a machine guess. being sentient? Like, is the train well. sentient? Is this just a big a dude that like Go carries people now. around? What is man? What? I don't know. These are questions that they don't talk about in the movie, and I like to think. I like to think. No, because. Head out that door and take a look. All right. Um. Well, okay. So, oh, okay, okay. First off, wait. So not all robots are like bipedal humanoids, right? No. Okay. Like so one of them, one of them, ha like they've had a couple that have like wheels, like the, the police guys got wheels. That's a lot of wasabi. <laughs> He's got a wheel. Even though he has two legs, they gave him, they were like, just give him a wheel. I mean, that's pretty close though. Is there like an ATM that's like, 
spitting out money and giving you shit for like not having a lot? Well, like clearly <laughs> their currency is screws, and you, you can and find scrap. it everywhere. I mean, if your currency is why are you screws, even doing this? Like they didn't even do anything to you. They were going to. Can you just meet random? Okay, that guy, that guy shot you. You should totally hit him. There's obvious. I, I don't know if they actually have. It. Oh no, they do. They do have the bad bots, which are like the main. Oh, battle bots! What? <laughs> you know, like I had a sudden epiphany while I was like battling all the wasabi in my nose. Spike kids. Should have been a video. Oh game god, they don't even have a movie. They don't have. You're, Ian you're McGregor. McGregor. What? Obi-Wan to do with voice. They just have like some rando dude that doesn't even sound anything like him. No, he sounds kind of like him. No. Maybe you're not like full Listen. grown yet. No, still. I am. You're pretty much going to be like this for the rest of the game. Yeah, you're a young adult bot. Okay. Like that turtle guy right there. That was a guy, right? That wasn't just like a thing. But like a dude. Are you inside of somebody? That's really the question as well. What is the planet? Who made the first robot? Man, question. Probably a robot. <laughs> and who made that robot? What Another about, robot. But what about uh, Tony Stark's like mechanical arm helper? <laughs> like, I love that dude. Is he a that, dude? That that that, that is. Good, good question. I, I remember Tony Stark going good boy. Yeah. So he treats him like a dog. Like a pet. He has a little so bit of So he has limited sentience. Yeah. So, like... I think, like, the only thing that has... Like, the only life he really created was Vision. So... And that's uh, because that was he, from Jarvis. Yeah. From the AI. Uh, he made so a... So they are... His AI is sentient enough. I mean, Edith... Edith is, is, is a thing, right? What? From, uh... The new Spider-Man, Far From Home. Edith? Oh, I haven't seen it. Huh? Yeah, uh, I haven't seen Far From Home. Honestly, I got burnt out after uh, Endgame. I was like, oh, I don't think they can top this anywhere. Uh, uh, anywhere? Anyway. Yeah. <laughs> he basically made like a replacement for Jarvis, and Edith stands for Even Dead. I am the hero. You oh, are nice. never uh, gonna shine, no matter what you're made of. It's a little hammy, but sounds cool. <laughs> I am. The hero? No, that doesn't work out. Even dead. I, the hero. <laughs> <laughs> oh. I'm big. I did a big dumb. But it's. Alright. <laughs> yeah, this is a lot of collecting and like. Oh, yeah. Around. But I mean, it's platforming. I don't know why it's a little bit of combat. Hey, I've got some scraps for the dog. Yeah, he sounds nothing like Eamon McGregor. Won't be one. Cause I'm trying. I'm the the first thing I'm gonna buy is like a magnetic thing that my little dude will just start picking up things. I can see that being useful. You can carry more than uh, two two hundred. Yeah, I got nuts that now. was that was the first upgrade that I got. That's like a lot of nuts. Crap. You're gonna like my nuts. You're gonna like my nuts. You're a bucket of bolts now. You're a bucket of bolts. Uh. Well, we should check it out after. We should watch the movie after this. <laughs> should we? Should we commentate? But movie podcast. <laughs> that's a that's a big bag of cards you got. Game over. <laughs> you want some you. No. Thank you. Though. I appreciate it. No, if I if I'm gonna if I'm gonna consume Ooh, some carbs, it's gonna be it's gonna be Sonic, garlic. Yeah. Bacon, I'm down to eat now. Like my stomach is kind of settled. Brought to you by Sonic the Hedgehog. It is so delicious. Chili dogs. <laughs> oh, I also downloaded Sonic Riders. Interesting. You ever, you ever play Sonic Riders? Yeah. Is that the one where they Amazing. have like the, the 
It sounds like to me in my brain, I'm imagining Sonic riding. They ride motorcycle. like the, the like boards. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I remember playing that. Now I think it's that so it. awesome. I hated it. <laughs> it was like insanely fast. It was it was one of the funnest racing games I ever played as a kid. Uh, what was I gonna say? But no, do you, know why, do you know why Sonic uses a board? Be, you know, since he, he's faster on foot, like, why doesn't he just... <laughs> yeah. Like, I, Because it wouldn't be fair. <laughs> That's why. Because he's so insanely fast. Like Has Sonic does, ever... Does Tails propel himself on his board? Uh, yeah. He's got, like, a... So Tails tail. is cheating. I Doesn't mean, Shadow have cheating. like a weird thing? I think he has like a gun that shoots out the back. <laughs> Great. He has a gun? So Shadow's always been toting guns. Well, I'm like, in the in the thing, I was like, I don't remember him having that. I, I don't remember, honestly. Wonderbot trick. Wonderbot trick. Return all what? I don't know. I'm, I'm getting this thing. Instead of just going to the city, they made a whole nother level. Okay, I gotta say this though. Are you just if Sonic bolts? the Ooh. if Sonic the Hedgehog is unrelated to Sonic's, now would be a good time for Sonic's to like monetize on Sonic the Hedgehog the movie, right? Like, come on, they have chili dogs for fuck's sake. Yes, uh, that connection should be made. You know what else should have been made? It just bothers me that they aren't connected. You know, uh, Dove Soap and Dove Chocolate, not the same people. <laughs> yes. It's totally an America thing, though, because outside of the U.S., there's totally separate things. It's crazy. You know what? Uh, Dove Chocolate does not exist outside of the U.S. Really? Mm -hmm. huh. That's why, like, um... There was a time you'll when you'll never Nintendo. find a bounty bar in the U.S., now but you'll find a mounds bar <laughs> or an almond joy. Yeah, I've never. I've oh, never I'm dead. Heard of that first thing. I died. Okay, bounty is literally an almond joy, sans almond. That's it. Okay. It's like a mounds with milk chocolate. Oh my God, I was in Canada. I died. And I I bought some Smarties. <laughs> Yeah, the the chocolate. M &M. No, because in America, Smarties are something else. That's what I'm saying. The rest of the fucking world calls things differently because the U.S. loves what is it? What is it? Metric or imperial? Yeah, imperial. Just weird like that. It's just so now I have homing shots. Once all the so I don't just die. waste my ammo on shit. We'll just switch to metric. We'll be fine. We're gonna do that once the boomers die out. What are you going to call a quarter the pounder? World. Of corpse. Like a one-eighth kilo? <laughs> a royale with cheese. Oh, yeah, that's right. <laughs> Suck it, Lee. <laughs> You're not wrong. You know what else also bothered me? Uh, uh, now. In Adventure Time... Finn's got the grass sword, and they never once called it a blade of grass. <laughs> I think you've told us that before. I have, at the yeah. bar. But it still bothers me very much. I think it's probably because it was too on the nose. You know. They're all very about on the nose. subtlety in, in Adventure Time. There's no subtlety at all in Adventure Time. That's a joke. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I'm saying. Like, it was just, like, too in your face. Like, yeah. We'll let the people, like, make that connection on their own. Oh, it's a blade of grass. Ha ha. Like you did. It would be explaining the joke. I love explaining the joke. That's how you know it's funny. <laughs> <laughs> the more you have to explain it, the funnier it is. That's how jokes work, right? Yeah. Okay, boomer. <laughs> He's not even a boomer. I know. Don't insult him like that. <laughs> oh. I gotta take this. This is a good recording. <laughs> You're hungover. 
I'm eating. Yeah, we've been we've all been eating. I'm like. Need more junk. Were you uh, talking on the phone in my pantry? Oh, yeah, your pantry. That's like it's like a little cubby. You can walk into it. So it's got great acoustics. Yeah. That's, where I, I, that's where I do all my voice acting. You should totally do that. <laughs> Honestly, I should. <laughs> ah. I feel like it would work oh, out yeah. well. Yeah, either that or like the closet. My closet is big enough. Did you ever, uh, did you like send in audition tapes for anything ever? Like Doomfist or something? Or, uh, you could be the next. <laughs> next no, I tried. You can be in robots too. The recordings always end up crap and I just like feel bad about myself. Because oh. I don't have good enough mics and shit. Don't let your dreams be dreams. These are all right. Mm -hmm. These our, are really good, actually. Our Guitar Hero mics. We all just want to be big rock stars. Living uh, on top dollar, driving 16 cars. Yeah, no, I don't the want that. The girls come easy, and the drugs come cheap. We'll all stay skinny because we just won't eat. I don't know what song that you're referencing. We'll hang out in the coolest bars with the VIPs and the movie stars. This Every bit that you're doing is gonna wind up there. Every Playboy bunny and their bleach blonde hair. Nobody's. Get, I'm not gonna this. haul out in the private this? rooms <laughs> with the latest yeah, dictionary. And the day's who's who will get you anything with that evil smile. Everybody's got a drug dealer on speed dial. Will hey hey, I wanna be a rock star. Woo! That was a Nickelback song. Oh. It's a, it's a song that rock stars have made about how they want to be rock stars. I don't know if that's sad or exciting. So it's a song for rock stars by rock stars. <laughs> yeah. I wouldn't Relatable. Consider, <laughs> I wouldn't consider Nickelback rock stars, but okay. I mean, they definitely have more money than most. I mean, they're not fair, fair. country singers, but I don't know what they actually are. They're just kind of like... Ah. I don't know if like it's if it's the game doing this, like if it's got a load. I gotta get that. Load. No, it's, uh, it's my thing. computer. Oh god damn! Did it. you mean to do that? <laughs> you should have some of these wasabi peas. It just like opens up all your pores. Your pores? Get, get out the way! <laughs> yeah, like my my nose is open, my face is open, my ears are open. I'm alright. Is there really like exfoliation happening? Oh, I mean like. I'll be real with y'all. I don't really even like wasabi. Aww. Well, then you are missing out on a world of flavor, yeah. sir. <laughs> it's okay. He's I, white. Yeah, I'm missing out on a lot of things. <laughs> I, I'm a very particular eater. That's how I keep this amazing shape. I'm just going to jump down. Yeah, what do you call your diet? <laughs> what do you uh, call your shape? Uh... An amazing shape. A square shape. I call it a hypotenuse. Hypotenuse. That's a hypotenuse. <laughs> a, uh, Math terms I don't remember anymore. A, a 16 sided die. Yeah. I'm a four sided die. Four sided which, die? Which is just. A pyramid? Yeah. <laughs> Make the mistake of. Hitting it with my wrench and it blew up in my face. <laughs> and I was just like, oh, yeah. Which is weird that it's like, it has a, a electric bolt, but it doesn't like electrify. Weird. Oh. Ooh, ooh. You're terrible at this. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not terrible. It's like, this is the eighth time that you've climbed up here. Well, like, I had to get I'll the thing. I'll be honest, I don't even remember how he got here. Like, I, got, I had to get the thing, and I had to jump down, and there was, like, no way to get back up. But now I'm going on to the next thing. Finally. Uh. Oh. Can't handle the speed. It's the steam. For you. Since when can Ow. you carry more uh, screws? Oh, I just got, I got the upgrade. Oh. Do you want to know what this looks like at 1080p? <laughs> All the way losers. <laughs> oh, 
Why are robots again, Q? Because I, I I really do like platformers, and this is like an okay platformer. It's I mean, as great... platforming goes, this is pretty. Like, I like the flying. Yeah. yeah that that's done. Pretty and you well. get like you get more stuff. Like right now, it's just kind of pretty boring. I don't know. It's just like it's just it's not exciting at all. It's not. Oh, yeah. It's no Jack and Daxter like. Oh yeah, it, it, it is not. I didn't never said I. It was. Well, I mean, the recipe was obscure, terrible. That's what we wanted. Yeah. This is what we got. I was like, this is what y'all wanted. <laughs> you wanted terrible games. I was like, I know the perfect one. And uh, I came in clutch with my obscure and terrible ones. <laughs> Let me get all these. I don't know. I feel like the Tourites is still pretty good, even though it's weird. It's it's very good. It has like just the weird prison thing. And the, yeah, and that like, like I said, that was like literally the worst part of the game. And like it's the game is only like four hours long, anyhow. Yeah. Did you guys ever play Katamari Damacy? What? I like I I the always Kamari knew what it was. I just never I played, played it. it. You never played it? It's pretty good. I played it. Yeah. It's pretty crazy. Bad. They have one, like, somebody played it on, they had, like, they brought their PSP. Yeah, yeah. And they were playing it, and they had, like, a thing where you can, like, change the shape. Oh, yeah, that was the Vita. That was on the Vita. Yeah. Because you couldn't do that without the touch screen. So you yeah. could, like, make it flat, like a big rectangle cylinder yeah. rolling pin. Or you could make it skinny, like a wheel. Yeah. I was like... It actually That's pretty sounds wild. Dope as fuck. Hey, yeah. No, Most of the time, it just it kind of like, like the, the game is to like make it a good shape so it rolls easy. When I think of like Katamari, I think like just the ball. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, a lot I, of it is the ball. Yeah. But, but it's, it's like, fun. Yeah. But how does the, the ball, ball is fun? Start? Like you, 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 Yeah. You start you off. Roll at, like what, what? How do you roll in? Like what? What's the, the base prince. ball? The prince. The prince rolls it. Okay. Oh, you mean like what's in the center? Yeah. Oh, the the katamari. Yeah. The katamari is what's yeah, like is collecting <laughs> the thing. Okay. It looks yeah. like a little weevil wobble. Yeah. You know this? What the fuck is a weevil oh, we, wobble? That's '90s Americana. This we got, we 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 gotta play like katamari a Furby? now. <laughs> no, no, it's like a it's like a ball uh. with like rubber spikes all around it. Oh, yeah! Like you used to twist it, and then it would shake, and, and so it was like it if you ground. squeeze it, it's rubber and has like a liquid in it. No, no, you're thinking of like a stress ball. Kind no, of it's thing. like a it's like a rubber like yo-yo thing with a ball at the end, and it's filled with a liquid. You squeeze it, and you oh, it's jiggling on the inside. I guess okay, that's not what I'm thinking. No, of. this isn't what I'm thinking either. I guess Weevil Wobbles is the wrong thing. The Weevil Wobbles they're, are the things that don't fall down. Yeah, okay. that's well, what they look like. They look like thinking? little Matryoshka dolls. Just look up Katamari. <laughs> Everybody look up Katamari so we know what we're talking about. <laughs> I fucking yeah, hate these parts. Oh, the dude. Fuck. He turns into a ball? No. No, no. no, that's the prince. He's, He's pushing, pushing around the Katamari. Like, like you're, you're not playing the ball or the Katamari. You're playing the prince. It looks like a weird hard candy. Or, or possibly his cousins. They also have the cousins that you can change into. They're like little models, and they're always like really crazy shaped. <laughs> Damn it. Now I need to figure out what this thing I'm is. The this. wording is so weird. <laughs> yeah, it looks like this. A uh, bumble ball? Bumble ball? Yeah, that's what I'm thinking of. It's bumble ball. Had a bunch of those whenever I was a kid. Oh, he came in for that swing. So like the shaking makes it just like bounce Sorry about that. Like all the time. <laughs> Kinda reminds me of like those balls with the tails on them that, that are moving. Yeah. 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 Like that. But with rubber things. Rubber things. Oh man, you remember Skippets? <laughs> what the hell are you talking about? Guys, <laughs> okay, keep it keep on focus. Well yeah, two thousand five, skip it. <laughs> Yeah, what else was yeah. it? What, what other movies? Like, because this says, I believe, DreamWorks. Is this DreamWorks? I believe. Shrek? And there was something else that, like, there was a thing, like, whenever, uh. God damn it. Like, uh, now, now I remember. Whenever Pixar came that, out with. Uh, Butter Bacon uh, Junior Burger from Sonic Exists. <sighs> Creating Sonic hungry. again. All right, most popular 2005 movies. 
King Kong, Batman Begins. Batman Begins? Since yeah, City. That. War Worlds. War of the Worlds. Match Point Blank. A lot of things. A lot of things going on. Lord Serenity. of War. 40 year old virgin, that's classic. <laughs> 2005. God, that movie. That was a Star Wars movie. I've never even got to watch it because I was always like too young to watch it. Star Wars? It's, it's alright. Episode 3 I imagine. Revenge of the Sith. Like, I remember it being like it was a movie to watch because they had boobs in it. And then it was like. I figured. I figured. And it, 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 that's what started, I feel, like all this, like the X rated version of comedy movies. That didn't really need to be X-rated or the unrated, and it's just like, oh, they have a pair of boobs in the middle of a movie. Wow. Wow. They're not even that great of boobs either, if I remember correctly. Most of the time, they aren't. They're they're a, they're, a no they're just good boobs. they're just average. Like I don't know. If you if you even got some boobs on there, like make sure they're good. I guess. But all all boobs are good. But it's just. I don't know. I'm being. They're sad boobs. I'm being picky for some reason. Yeah, y'all just get up. <laughs> oh. We can get a game voiceover recording movie, a bonus feature. Yeah. Instead of, you know, buying some actual good shit, you could buy, uh... Bonus features. Yeah, bonus features. Oh, I'm buying those. I don't want to... What's this? Shot? Just, like, crunch those into the mic. Just get some ASMR in here. Yes. <laughs> yeah, they're gonna pick up on all the... You just had Reese's Puffs. Reese's Puffs. Reese's Puffs. What? Reese's Puffs, Reese's Puffs. I have both. Peanut butter chocolate flavor. I'm glad you guys uh, glossed over the fact that I accidentally said Revenge of the Synth. <laughs> <laughs> like, like. Well, I knew what you meant. pointed it out. Yeah. Like a really, that would be a really, really dope, like, DJ album. <laughs> like, that, that's the, uh, the synth wave. Like a, a vapor wave, but it has to be synth, and it has to take samples synth from... Synth wave has to die first before you can do Revenge of the Sith. Yeah. yeah. And it's never gonna die. Oh, so Especially with, uh... The Weeknd's new album. Have y'all... Do y'all listen to The Weeknd? Do y'all listen no. to popular music? Uh, <laughs> no. I don't listen to music. I'm a basic bitch. I still listen to, like, the Beatles and shit. Is anime <laughs> themes a thing? Well, The Weeknd... The Weeknd's pretty good. And he made Blinding Light, which is... Fucking synth wave as shit. Which he did do Kavinsky like a while back, which was is like a big synth wave. I like synth wave artist person. I like so, Outrun. You guys, it's the same thing. You guys remember? God damn it! You guys remember whatever? Outrun happened? is the look. I feel. No, vaporwave is the all-encompassing thing. No, vaporwave is a totally different thing. <laughs> I don't know enough about music. Vaporwave is like 90s vaporware music. Like slow down 80s or 90s with like vaporware tracks behind it. Like it's a totally different thing. You guys remember whatever happened to Robot Jones? <laughs> that sounds familiar. What is that? That's an old Cartoon Network TV show about a, a little robot that is like... Uh, does, he, does he have like the 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 glass head? Yeah, he's got like a, yeah, a light yeah. bulb. Yeah, him. yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember that. It was like I forgot about that. He had a crush on a girl with like uh, like the the super intensive headgear braces. Oh yeah, that's not ring about uh, bell mm -hmm. at all. I'm surprised because it was. I remember that movie. I remember, that show. It wasn't that great, but it it had like a, at least like a different art style well the music was insane i saw like one commercial and i was like oh my god this is amazing this is what my life needs to be about now and and it just died <laughs> <laughs> that's yeah. sad <laughs> it was pretty uh, that's the way things go what is it called again whatever happened to robot jones whatever happened to robot jones yeah uh, which is a pretty meta name now 
that it died out. <laughs> it died out pretty quickly. Yeah. Like it was only on Cartoon Network for. Yeah. It was like there was. It was like, like around the time not, when like not even most of like all the, like uh, experimental shows. Back yeah. Then. Like Codename Kid Next Door. Yeah. Uh, hey, Grim, Grim, Grim Adventures of Billy and Mandy. It didn't but, like, really stand the test. They of time had at all. those two. Y'all remember that other show that was part of the Grim Adventures of Billy and Mandy? The, Evil uh, Con Carne. Yeah. I but like they had, that. like, a show that was, like, both of them. Yeah, it's The Grim um, Adventures of Billy and Mandy. It's both of them at, at the same time. Evil Concarne is the spinoff. No, like, they, well, they, in the beginning, they had two shows. Like, or, like, the one show, and it showed, like, an episode of both. Of, like, a Billy and Mandy episode and then an uh, Evil Concarne episode. But then Evil Con Carnage just kind of fell out, and they just kept on doing with Billy and Mandy. Yeah, spun off, uh, spun it off. Like they split it in half into two separate shows. Yeah, but there was like a, a name for that show. There was like something. This, this show does not ring a bell at all. I'm looking at pictures, and like I don't remember this at all. Yeah, he had like the bridge. I'll play you the commercial later. <laughs> but uh, no, they had really great music. It was like eight bit, like jazz. <laughs> you know what had pretty good music? Uh, class of 3000. Well, yeah, because it's fucking uh, Andre, Andre 3000 that was on it. Like, of course it would have good music. I would hope it had good music. <laughs> Makes sense for it to have good music. <sighs> so far, how how are you enjoying this game? <laughs> yeah. Um, Like, uh, I don't know how... Like, where does the dopamine come from? Like, there's um, no emotional attachment to anything that's happening for me. I, 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 I I'm, I'm a simple person. I do, I, I do the thing. I collect the thing, and brain is like, good. <laughs> I mean, it's just like it's not. It's like, it's, good, good, do more. It's just like it's not even exciting to look at. It's just like platforming. Robot you want to try? You want to feel? All right, I'll feel. Because it's, it doesn't feel bad. The jumping's a little clunky, but it's like, robotic. And the controls are old, like the controller, that it feels kind of bad. Yeah. yeah. Headache went away. Not well, really hungover cool. now anymore. Wonderbar. <laughs> no. Um. Yeah. All these all these robots remind me of whatever happened to Robot Jones. And I just saw like uh, the OK. It's KO like crossover Nexus episode, like the other day. I wish more of the robots in uh, Fallout. Or it, like, like this. it teams up with. Uh, uh, Raven from Teen Titans. Yeah, Raven's there, and uh, uh, Finn is the the one that like saves the day in the end. Yeah, because he turns into Finn. Well, he turns into everybody. Like Ben Ten, like uses his even Generator watch. Rex. That's a, a good lot show. Of stuff going on there. Watched, Johnny Bravo. You ever watched Generator yeah, Rex? Yeah, the, the Johnny Johnny Bravo was in there. No, I I, I don't have any exposure to Generator Rex. Uh, that's something I watched in my like adult life because I missed out on it when I was a kid good show like honestly like it's you thought ben 10 was good generator rex is even better i oh. i actually never gave ben 10 a chance because i didn't like the way i remember was. watching the first couple episodes whatever oh I man i loved ben 10 oh you like, gotta go down there oh really yeah you gotta go do that thing. but ben 10 is basically common writer so <laughs> like, everything is common writer <laughs> if you think about it uh, uh circle is the the hit oh the, are you I, dead you you broke your leg Put your legs back on. I don't, I don't even know what happened. You got hit by those dudes. But yeah, you're not wrong. Uh, ben 10 is basically common rider. Wow, wow, Q, you really made that look easy. Like he, <laughs> yeah. You'll, you'll the controller is in his hands. Like five minutes later, he's dead. <laughs> you didn't die once. Yet. All right, all right. I'll be honest. Can we pause for a little bit? Yeah. Okay. All right. Pause. I want to go for a smoke break. Okay. All right, we're back. Yee. Yeah. Right, uh, so we're just gonna save real quick. E. I mean, uh, we, we probably didn't even need to like come back is for the, the saving, but okay. Save. I mean, is it a start save? I feel like no, it would have been so a... abrupt. Uh, what's the thing? I mean, we probably miss out on some like primo like banter. <laughs> I can digitally save. <laughs> <laughs> if you want, it's whatever. Uh. I can't find the thing, so yeah, maybe we should just do that. <laughs> I can't find the same thing. All right, all right, all right. Oh, wait. Hey, Dylan, want to try a chili cheese plate? Oh. And there I we think. go.